first of all, the basics to uh, Call of Duty games in every first-person shooter. A defensive position is always better than an attacking of position. Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. This is HD Commentary with DGN, and we are YouTube. Today I want to be talking about a few things of Modern Warfare 3, actually one thing, and that is how to become a better player at this game. Uh, I got the game at the release, I played it so much already, and right now I actually found out the way how to become a better player in this game. In this video I will be explaining that for you, but first of all I'm going to be introducing myself to this channel because TJN is officially new to me, and you know what, it is a great experience, I'm going to be... Having a lot of fun with this channel as well, because, yeah, you know, it's just something more. Something more exposure, more people to talk with. I don't know, it's just really cool. The community is just epic. So, let me introduce myself real quick. My name is Bob, I'm 16 years old, and I live in the Netherlands. And yeah, that's right, I'm a Euro European, I'm not American or something. I'm not from the UK, so English is not my native language. And you know what? I wish it was. I love English, I love everything about it, the language is awesome, and you know, I, I love talking in English, so that's why I'm doing my commentaries in English. Some people are actually doing it in Dutch, and I think that's crap, so I'm not doing that. <laughs> Alright, so I want to get to the topic right now, before getting too much of topic. Uh, if you want to know more about me, go ahead and go to my channel, because I have a lot of information there about me, so definitely go there and... I'll see you there. <laughs> so, how to become a better player at Modern Warfare 3? People are asking these questions already, and you know, when I, you know, uh, in Black Ops, I actually was a pretty good player. I got really, really good scores every game, and you know, Black Ops is just it's natural feeling when I'm playing in that game. It's just easy, and when I come to Modern Warfare 3, actually, the first few days, I was like. Wow, this game is hard to play, and it, it actually was, it's so different than Black Ops. If you compare it to each other, Black Ops needs like 5 bullets to kill someone, and in Modern Warfare 2 it's like 2 or 1 bu bullet to kill someone, so that's definitely a difference, and that's just the entire thing of Modern Warfare, it's way faster, faster paced, and I love that, you know, it, it's really cool, I think they did a pretty good job with that, but it's a different playstyle, and I gotta develop my own skills for it again. Now, after a few days, actually after five days, and that was today, uh, I actually noticed how to play this game and how to get good scores on it. Because, y you know what, um, it's different, because in Black Ops I could rush and get a lot of kills, but in this game you need to get your own tactics. And I found a way to get a good gameplay, and it's actually how all the pros are doing it right now. So, first of all, the basics to uh, Call of Duty games in every first-person shooter. A defensive position is always better than an attacking of position. You can see it as a search and destroy. If you're defending the bombs, it's way easier than planting the bombs. Because when you're defending the bombs, you're just sitting there, actually sitting at one spot and watching one direction and make sure that nobody can pass that every area. And that's actually how you want to be playing Modern Warfare 3 as well. You've got to take those defensive positions and not the attacking of positions. As you can see right here, I'm defending. I'm defending these stairs and this entire area, actually. And when there is anyone who comes to me, he will die. Because I got that posi uh, defensive position. I got the cover and everything, actually, to my advantage. Now, you guys probably know Woody's Gamertag. He's a famous YouTube commentator for Call of Duty series. And if you don't know him yet, um, he is a really good commentator. He has, like, I don't know, a lot of subscribers already. Uh, but he's doing a great job, and what I learned from him is that whenever he has a gunfight, he will not make it fair. He will make it so that uh, he will get the advantage over the gun battle. You don't want to have him having the advantage, because then it's all about your aim. And that's not what you want to have, unless you're one of the best aimers in the world, one of the best players. Uh, and, you know, Wounded Gamertag isn't the best player, but he knows how to play the game, he has his own tactics for it. And that's what you got to develop in playing uh, Call of Duty series. Um, every game is different, but for Modern Warfare 3, you know, you can find it out after one week or it may take one month. I don't know, but eventually you will find your own strategy to play this game. And my strategy is take those present defensive positions like here 
you know, I got this cover from this uh, tree, you know, and he doesn't, he attack me, I will defend, you know, I get the kill, because it's way easier for me to kill him. It, if you're not able to kill him then, then you should really practice your gun skills, because then you're pretty pathetic, but... <laughs> you know what, when you're not, you just... You should win every gunfight, and you should be pretty fine about it, you know? When you're just playing defensively and get those right shots on target, you know, get that cover for you, then it will be all fine. So make sure the advantage is yours, and that's actually my main tip of the day. And that's actually not only for Modern Warfare 3, but also for all the other Call of Duties. Uh, I've been doing this for all the Call of Duties. Uh, in Black Ops, I actually had the ability to just rush into it, because... You know, when when having a good aim in Black Ops, you also could win every game. Because it wasn't so fast-paced, you don't need two bullets to die. Those people have to hit you five times. Or something like that. And you know, in Modern Warfare 3, it's different. They kill you in two bullets, so they just, you know, they only have to spray you down and you're dead. That's the difference. And in, Mo in Black Ops, they are most of the time not really spraying, and if they're spraying, you can still take them down. Because you can hit everything and they might miss some bullets. So, that's the difference between those games. Once again, the tip for Modern Warfare 3. Make sure you are the defender. And make sure you get that advantage over the gunfight. That was it for today. Thank you for watching. This was Bob from HD Commentary with TGN. I hope you guys enjoyed the commentary. If you did, make sure you press the like button. Because it helps us out. And I hope to see you guys next time. Peace out. First of all,